Hi guys! So today we are going to talk about volume and capacity. Now, what is volume and capacity? Very good question. So capacity tells us the total amount of liquid that a container can hold. And volume tells us how much liquid there is or how much space it takes up in the container. But first, can you think of some liquids that might use capacity? Hmm. Well, water's liquid, orange juice, oil, milk. Yeah, actually there's quite a lot of things that are liquids. So capacity is pretty important. Why would we need to know how much liquid a container or object can hold? What about if I was going to the beach on a very, very hot day? I might need to know how much liquid or water my water bottle can hold. If it's a very small water bottle, is that going to be enough water for the whole day? No. But if it has a greater capacity, like this big one, then I know I'll be set for the whole day. So I need to know how much liquid these containers can hold so I know I'm prepared. Why else may I need to know about capacity? What about if I'm making a cake? Yeah, think of some liquids that we might need to put into our cake, like oil or milk. If I put too much, it's going to be a pretty runny cake. And if I don't put enough, it might be really, really hard. So I need to know the exact amount of liquid I need to put into my cake mixture. Oh, okay. When comparing capacities, sometimes it's pretty easy to tell if something has a greater capacity and can hold more liquid, and if something has a smaller capacity and can hold a little less liquid. For example, this adorable cup. Now, you can see it does hold a little bit of liquid, but if I fill it up past you, it's going to overflow. Let's get another one and compare the capacities. Whoa. Now, if we use these two in comparison, I don't think I even need to measure to know that this big guy holds a lot more liquid than this little cute one. Sometimes it's not that easy. Let's take a look at these two containers. Together, we are going to conduct a little test to see which container has the greater capacity. Before we start, can you make a prediction, which means have a guess, as to which container has the greatest capacity and holds the most amount of liquid? Let's test it out. Let's fill both of these containers right up to the top. I'm going to see how many times each container fills up this small glass and then compare the two. Let's start with the one on the left. Ready? One, two, three. Wow, this container filled up my small glass three times. Okay, let's test out the other container. One, two, three, four, five. So this container filled up my small glass five times. So this container would have the greater capacity. Now it's your turn to explore capacity. Can you find some containers lying around and see if you can test which has the greater capacity? I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye guys.